Miss Melinda here, your spiritual worker from Miss Melinda's Metaphysical Services.com, here to talk to you a little bit about how I see ghosts. So, this topic has come up in our spirit chats, and the reason that it has come up is because we talk a lot about psychic development, and people have been wondering is the phenomenon of seeing ghosts or seeing spirits, is that related to a specific psychic ability? So in my experience and from my perspective, this ability or this phenomena is associated both with clairvoyance as well as with mediumship. So in order to see ghosts, you have some propensity with both of those psychic abilities. And with clairvoyance, usually people are under the impression that when you're able to see things such as a ghost, that you will see them as clear as you see a person in front of you or as clear as you see the room around you. But typically when you see ghosts or you see energy or you see this kind of phenomena associated with the world beyond the veil or the unseen world, um, it's not so clear. It's not as crisp and as solid as another human would be, right? So the way that I see ghosts or spirits, I prefer to call them spirits, um, is like a form of light. It's a light being. So what I'm seeing is their energy. So it looks like a light or it looks like a cloud, sort of. Um, well formed, it will be in the form of a person or in the form of a being and it will move more like a being or a person would move. So this is something formed kind of like a cloud, um, looks light, has some light in it or is made of light and it will move the way that a person or a being or an entity will move rather than um, the way that a cloud or the, the way that a light ray would move. It looks semi-solid, meaning that you can see that it has three-dimensional shape. So it has form and you can't really see through it. You can tell that it's not solid. You can tell that it's light and energy, but you can't really see through it. You don't look at it from one side and see the room out the other side. Um, so when it's in front of you, you cannot see all the way through it. Um, there are some beings that will appear a little bit more clearly. There are times when I have seen faces, um, but usually they are not appearing in a fully formed body. Now, this also has something to do with how developed the spirit is or how evolved the spirit is. So sometimes um, some spirits have the ability to fully manifest themselves, whereas others do not. So it depends on the spiritual evolution of the spirit itself, like what it has learned to do or what it has evolved to do thus far, as well as the clairvoyance of the individual and the mediumship of the individual. So some people may see spirits um, almost fully formed, if not fully formed, and some people may not. And it depends on all of these variables. Uh, according to how you see these things depends upon all of these different variables, both the abilities of the spirit as well as the strength of the clairvoyance of the individual as well as the strength of the mediumship of the individual. So there may be people that have such strong clairvoyance or such strong mediumship skills that they can see or do frequently see fully formed spirits when those spirits are able to present themselves as fully formed. For me, the way that it works for me is they're typical, typically like a cloudy light form that moves like a human that is mostly solid and that also has a, a feeling and an energy associated with it as well. So there are other senses that I'm also using that let me know when this is a spirit. It's very obvious. Um, there have been times when I've seen faces and there have been times when I've seen people almost fully formed but not quite and at those times it still seems as if 
they're mostly made of light or mostly cloudy material. It's like you'll just see some outlines of their body and maybe some outlines of their clothes or a few features, but it won't be completely formed the way that another person in front of me would be. So I hope that answers your question about how I see spirits as well as about how these gifts work in order to allow you to see spirits. And I hope you enjoy the video and I hope that you stay blessed.